everybody. Carolina Ocean Studies weather report for May 15th. We are looking at a thermometer that is measuring the temperature, the abiotic temperature at 74 degrees today. And that temperature has been very important, how it's been impacting this habitat. Okay, this is a monarch butterfly human-made habitat, but it all started out in the wild when a monarch butterfly laid eggs on this milkweed plant, and those eggs eventually turned into caterpillars, and those caterpillars eventually made their way up to create these amazingly beautiful crystallis. You'll see some of the ones that have already hatched. These are ones that are not ready to hatch yet. And then around this side, I think you can see this gorgeous one right here. We can see that one's getting darker. You can almost see it's translucent. We can see in there it's getting ready to hatch. And then here's one that recently hatched. And I'm going to bring it out here because it is warm enough today. A few days ago, it might not have been warm enough for this butterfly. Sorry. To have hatched. And in fact, in our inland counties where it got close to freezing, they would have been in great danger. So the temperature, that abiotic factor, really impacts these beautiful biotic creatures, right? And this year, because we've had some record lows, um, that really slowed down probably their development because they have to wait for 55 degrees or greater for them to be able to fly. They're cold-blooded. Those body systems really slow down. Anyways, that's the amazing abiotic plus biotic works together, creates a habitat slash ecosystem for today. Double Dog Dairy to go on YouTube, check out some Monarch videos, find out some more. Over and out.